Let's imagine you have two wireless earbuds or two wireless headphones. By the way, this is Soundcore A20i and one more Sonoflow. And you want to connect them to your Windows PC at the same time. Believe it or not, but it's quite possible. For example, to watch movies with your wife or girlfriend. You know what? It's not my business. But I can show you how to connect them to your Windows PC. So let's get it started. And here we go, we are in Windows 10, also it will work on Windows 11 as well. Firstly, you need to open your browser and type next. Virtual Audio Cable and press enter. Scroll down a little bit, then you need to navigate to this website, link I will leave in the video description. Click on it. As you can see, this is Virtual Audio Cable VAC. We need to scroll down a little bit. You may notice that we have a trial version. Also, we have a full version, which is not free, but also we can download the light version, which is totally free. You can find it here. Download VAC Lite, zip archive, click on it. For example, I will save it to my desktop. Click on save. Voila, now we can close the browser. Next step is quite simple. You need to unzip the archive. Click on the right mouse button and select extract. Now we need to open this folder. Double click. Find setup 64. Click on the right mouse button and run it as administrator. Virtual audio cable will be installed on your computer. Select yes. Accept all the terms and conditions. It's not necessary to check this option, just click install. Now you need to wait a few seconds. In this window, you just need to select yes. For now on, we will close this window, click OK. Installation completed successfully, click here. Now we can close this window. Let's proceed to the next stage. You need to connect your earbuds or headphones to the laptop. For example, I will connect Soundcore A20i and headphones one more Sonoflow. So you need to turn on your earbuds. Then you need to navigate to Bluetooth. In Windows 10, it's quite easy. You just need to click on show hidden icons and select Bluetooth. Click on the right mouse button, select add a Bluetooth device. In this window, select Add Bluetooth or Other Device. In our case, we will select the first option. As you can see, this is my Soundcore A20i and of course, one more Sonoflow. Firstly, I will connect to the Soundcore earbuds. Click on it. Mission accomplished. One more time, I will click here. But this time, I will connect to one more Sonoflow. Click on it. I succeed. Now click on done. We can close this window. After connecting, we will navigate to the sound settings. So here you may see sound icon. I will click on the rightmost button and select sound. In the playback, you need to click on the rightmost button when you will find line one, click on it, and be sure to select set as default communication device. It is very important. One more time, click here, set default. The same thing, repeat here in the recording, line 1. After doing this, you can close this window. You need to click on search and type audio repeater. Click on the right mouse button, run it as administrator, select yes. And repeat the same process twice. Click on the search. Here you may see audio repeater run as administrator great here you will see two windows in wave in you need to select microsoft sound mapper but in the second window you need to select line one virtual audio cable then in the wave out you need to select your earbuds or headphones Firstly, I will select Soundcore. Please take a close look because you need to select headphones and not headsets. So I will select headphones Soundcore A20i stereo. And here I will select as well headphones. Headphones one more Sonoflow stereo. Click on it. After all this process, you just need to click on start. And voila, you successfully connected your 
earbuds. That is, you can use your earbuds and headphones at the same time. No jokes. I want to mention if you want to use again your speakers, you need to navigate to the sounds. And in the playback, you just need to select Realtek Audio, which is your speakers. Then your speakers will work again. It's important to know. My conclusions. You can connect two wireless headphones or earbuds to your Windows system without any problems. At least everything worked out for me the first time. If this video was helpful for you, please like it and I recommend watching this video on how to fix laptop overheating.